Hi everyone, this is Grace. How are you? You know, we would live up to age 100 and we would be working until age 80. So let's redesign your life. I mean, I really want you to redesign your life. Today's topic is about your relationship, more like a business relationship. You know, it says, they say, it's not what you do but it's who you know that's very important it's who you know and uh, i was 25 years old that my father got sick and i lost everything i lost my career but i came back on my feet less than five years i earned abundance that's because partially because who i knew or whom I became friends with. So I'd like to share with you some things that I learned in my life. And now is the holiday season. You know, holiday season is a great time to get connected with right people. You, know, you have to do the right things yourself, but you need to know the right people. You have to meet the right people. So this is what I suggest. Today, I'd like to talk with you how to get connected with professionals. By professionals, I mean medical doctors, lawyers, CPAs, all those people you wish to have in your inner circle because they are power people. They have better knowledge than you and they have a better experience maybe than you. So they can be a very good resource in case you need some help. So here is what happened. You might go to your alumni meeting, Christmas party, or church meeting, or whatever, community meeting, and then you happen to come across with a lawyer, or medical doctor, or a dentist, pharmacist, CPA, and so on, so on, or business owners, entrepreneurs. Now, the problem many people do, so please don't do this. Many people make a mistake because they think they should take advantage of those people by asking questions and get the information for free. That's the mistake many people make. People think people don't value other people's time. People don't value knowledge or information many people think those are free the minute you do that you will never 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 meet the right people in your life you wouldn't get the good resource you wouldn't make a friend friends with a professional because they are professionals they want you to respect their time they want you to respect their professions so what I mean is, don't ever ask free consulting, okay? Don't ever ask questions at the party, hoping they will answer you for free. That's what many people do. And in a way, those people who do that, or those people who never appreciate the other person's time or professions or knowledge, they'll never make it to the top. Well, sometimes, they, you know, some sneaky people can go up, but they can come down very quickly, trust me. So, so this is what you have to do. When you meet lawyer or medical doctor or any professionals at the party, all you have to do is, oh, good. You know, I've been looking for lawyer like you, or I've been looking for a medical doctor like you, or I've been looking for a city assemblyman or politician like you can i make an appointment with you i'll come see you in your office see that's the keyword i'll come see you in your office meaning you respect them as a professional you are willing to pay them for their time and then even further you can ask how much would you charge per hour for the first consultation how much would you charge per hour 
for your first consultation. By saying that, you shine. They think, oh, you respect my profession. You respect me as a professional. You are willing to pay my hourly rate. You know, by doing that, they love you. They say, oh, don't worry. The first consultation is free. So here is my phone number. Make an appointment with my secretary. Okay? Please do that. Don't ever try to take advantage of those professionals. Don't think you are smart by getting their free advice. Don't, 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 don't ever do that. You show them you are a person with integrity. You show them that you respect their time by asking, okay, I want to make an appointment. I'll come see you in your office. You know, the reason is when you come see them in their office, they can charge you office visit like a medical doctor. The minute you step into their office, they can charge you office visit. Can be $60 per hour or $200 per hour. So you tell them, I'll see you in your office. You are willing to pay them. And then you ask them, how much would you charge per hour for the first consultation? Most likely, if you are like this, you show them your integrity. They'll say, oh, don't worry, the first consultation is free. And we talk about it. We go from there. If they say that to you, you are recognized as somebody better than average people. Because average people always want to take advantage for free information. And please remember, free is evil. If you want to get free something, that tells people you are sneaky, f cheap person. You are trying to always take advantage of your friend. Don't ever, ever, ever do that. Okay? All right. So that's a very small hint, but this will make you shine over average people. So please start practicing this weekend and the holiday season. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.